Once upon a time, in a mysterious and foreboding forest shrouded in darkness, there lived a magnificent black cat named Midnight. Midnight was no ordinary feline. She was double the size of a regular cat and possessed an eerie, shimmering black fur that seemed to swallow light. But despite her magical abilities, Midnight found herself trapped in a nightmarish existence. Midnight was owned by a wicked and powerful witch named Morgana, known for her sinister reputation throughout the land. The witch's decrepit cottage stood atop a hill, surrounded by gnarled trees that twisted and contorted like skeletal fingers. The air around the cottage was thick with a foul stench, and the howls of distant creatures echoed through the darkness. Morgana's presence was a constant source of terror for Midnight. The witch's cold, piercing eyes seemed to follow her every move, and her cackling laughter sent shivers down the cat's spine. Midnight knew that Morgana's magic was not to be underestimated, and the witch's dark spells kept her firmly under her control. Every night, as the moon cast eerie shadows through the tiny window of the cottage, Midnight gazed longingly at the distant stars, yearning for freedom. The forest surrounding the cottage whispered tales of those who had tried to escape but had vanished without a trace, swallowed by the darkness that lurked within. One night, as the blood-red moon hung low in the sky, Midnight decided it was time to make another daring attempt to escape. She waited until Morgana was deeply immersed in her wicked rituals, and the vile incantations sent shivers through the forest. With her heart pounding loudly in her chest, Midnight crept stealthily through the chilling darkness, trying to avoid the malevolent eyes of the witch. Each step felt like an eternity, the forest seeming to conspire against her with rustling leaves and eerie moans. But just as she thought she might succeed, Morgana's senses alerted her to Midnight's escape. The witch's sinister laughter echoed through the forest as she unleashed her dark magic, sending shadows that slithered like serpents, reaching out to ensnare the terrified feline. Desperate to flee, Midnight ran with all her might, her eyes wide with fear. But the forest seemed to warp and twist around her, the path she knew so well leading her in circles, trapping her within its haunting embrace. In her second attempt, Midnight stumbled upon a desolate graveyard hidden deep within the forest. The tombstones stood like ghostly sentinels, their cold stone surfaces reflecting the pale moonlight. The air was heavy with an oppressive stillness, and the spirits of the restless dead seemed to watch her every move. With trepidation, Midnight tiptoed through the graveyard, hoping the spirits would not alert Morgana to her presence. But the deceased had their own ancient ties to the witch, and their ghostly whispers filled her ears with chilling warnings. Unfazed, Midnight continued, pushing her fear aside, determined to break free from the clutches of the witch. She darted through the tombstones, trying to evade Morgana's relentless pursuit, but the grave seemed to shift and change, leading her deeper into the labyrinth of the undead. The ghostly wails echoed through the graveyard, causing Midnight's fur to stand on end. Yet, she pressed on, her heart pounding louder with each passing moment. In the distance, she could hear the echoes of Morgana's wicked laughter, growing closer with each step. As the night wore on, Midnight found herself standing on the edge of a murky swamp, its stagnant waters stretching into the darkness beyond. The air was heavy with a noxious scent, and eerie glows danced on the surface of the swamp, revealing the sinister creatures that lurked within. With nowhere else to run, Midnight waded into the murky waters, her heart beating wildly in her chest. The swamp seemed to have a mind of its own, tugging at her paws, trying to pull her down into its depths. Morgana's dark magic closed in around midnight, twisting the shadows of the swamp into grotesque shapes that reached out hungrily for her. The witch's cackles echoed through the night as she relished the imminent capture of her terrified pet. But as midnight felt the chilling grasp of the swamp pulling her under, something within her snapped. Her eyes blazed with a newfound ferocity, and a surge of ancient magic surged through her veins, raw and untamed. In her final desperate attempt, Midnight unleashed her true power, creating a blinding burst of light that dispersed the darkness around her. The swamp creatures recoiled in fear, and the witch's dark spells faltered, unable to withstand the brilliance of Midnight's magic. With a mighty leap, Midnight broke free from the clutches of the swamp and soared through the air. She fled through the forest, her magical aura now shining like a guiding star, leading her to freedom. But Morgana was relentless. She pursued Midnight with even greater determination, 
her fury intensified by the cat's defiance. The witch's malicious laughter rang through the trees, echoing with malevolence. However, Midnight's newfound power was not to be underestimated. She weaved through the forest, calling upon the spirits of the haunted graveyard and the creatures of the murky swamp, rallying them to her aid. A spectral army rose to protect Midnight, their chilling presence enveloping the forest in an otherworldly fog. As Morgana closed in for the final strike, she was met with a legion of ghostly apparitions and haunting creatures, their eyes glowing with an ethereal light. The battle that ensued was a terrifying display of magic and malevolence, darkness clashing with the shimmering brilliance of Midnight's newfound strength. The very fabric of the forest seemed to tremble with the intensity of their struggle. Yet, Midnight was undeterred. With the spirits of the forest on her side, she unleashed a powerful surge of magic that overwhelmed Morgana's dark spells. The witch's eyes widened in disbelief as she witnessed her power crumbling before her very eyes. In a final act of defiance, Morgana attempted one last malevolent spell, but Midnight deftly countered it, redirecting the wicked magic back at the witch. The spell struck Morgana, consuming her in a vortex of darkness, sealing her fate. The forest fell eerily silent as the dark magic dissipated, leaving only the ghostly remnants of Morgana's presence. Midnight stood victorious, her heaving breaths echoing through the haunted trees. The spirits of the forest, grateful for their newfound freedom from Morgana's tyranny, bowed before Midnight, bestowing upon her the title of the Guardian of the Shadows. From that day forth, the forest creatures lived in peace, knowing that Midnight would protect them from the terrors that lurked within the darkness. And so, dear little one, whenever the moon casts its eerie glow upon the forest, remember the tale of Midnight, the brave and formidable black cat who faced unimaginable horrors to break free from her captor. And know that even in the darkest of nights, there are whispers of courage and hope that can lead us to conquer the most terrifying of nightmares. Sweet dreams, everyone. Until next time.